Hello! Alright, so I'm just gonna be kind of a serious uh, video today, like, because uh, something happened uh, to a player on this serve that I thought was really uh, not, not cool, like, that's kind of upsetting, right? And this is something, I've played this game for two and a half years, probably more than that, like, about two and a half years, um, and I've never heard about this or seen something like this happen to anybody before, I mean, like, certainly not on this server, um, but a player on this server... Oh, uh, Brumbun. I uh, had his name changed. I think you can find it right here. See, they changed his name. The uh, Like I said, they changed his name to player 37078810, which I assume is probably his player ID. Yeah, so just changed it to his player ID number, which, like I said, obviously that's irritating. And right, what, what caused this change was that, uh, like I said, a lot of people have been putting, like, pro-Ukrainian messages in their names. I've, like I said, you know, is that for whatever reason, that apparently they're deciding to... Uh, you know, censor, but his was, his was just stop Ukraine war, which is not even necessarily pro Ukraine, just like it's more humanitarian in that, right? He just wants the war to stop, which I think most people do, unless you're like a horrible person who likes the mass murder of civilians. I don't know. But uh, if you if you think that's a good thing, then yeah, no, sad. But stopping Ukraine war, like not even necessarily political, it's not offensive. I mean, I don't, I just wouldn't find that offensive. And Right, it's super weird because I've seen names like like that are very political all the time. Uh, in this game for a long time, I mean, that we've had names like this guild has a guy named Free Palestine. Right, that's a name that some people might interpret political. I mean, that's right. Like I said, that's a, that's a name. I, as far as I know, he's had that name for quite a while, and that's not been an issue. But Right, so all of a sudden, though, people questioning the ties of Nexters to Russia, and all of a sudden, they're censoring uh, pro-Ukraine names. Uh, you know, like I said, that's stuff, definitely something that's uh, very problematic, and something that's, uh, I said, because I've never seen them apply this. They, like I said, they sent him a message. I'll read this to you in a second, but uh, they sent him a message saying that this is their policy, and that they're consistent. I'm like, really? Are you consistent? Because I've seen names like this as long as I've played the game. Um, like, we also have names that have, like, this one sort of has a religious context to it. Voodoo is a real-world religion with 20 million followers. Um, this is a name that some people might find offensive because it has a religious context to it, but he's had this name as long as he's played on this server, for, like, as far as I know. Um, like, at least a long time. So it's like, yeah, it's not definitely not a, it's definitely not a policy that is applied consistently at all, and I've never even heard of it happening before. Um, like I said, so the fact that they're doing it for a name that is as benign as Stop Ukraine War, uh, you know, definitely, definitely upsetting because, you know, you have to question, uh, Nexer's motivations because you want to, like I said, you kind of, like I said, you know, people already questioned their ties to Russia. They didn't, they put out a uh, kind of a weak statement saying, you know, about, oh, how they are sad about the situation, but they didn't. They didn't say what the situation was. They didn't condemn Russia's aggression, which anybody, right, Vladimir Putin is very bad in doing some, it said, you know, is, you know, deserves to be condemned for what he's doing in Ukraine. I mean, mass murder civilians is wrong. I mean, and we're seeing, right, you know, over 3 million people have left Ukraine um, since this started, which is horrific. And, you know, the death toll's rising. Um... Right, and it's like you, it's like a city like Kiev, right? Is like they're trying to, like I said, they've been attacking Kiev and attacking the cities on the outskirts of Kiev. I mean, Kiev itself is the seventh largest city in all of Europe. I mean, there's almost three million people just in that city alone. And then once you get into the metropolitan area, it's all the outskirts. I mean, we're like, it's like a metropolitan area of like five or six million people. I mean, it's a densely populated urban area, and Russian soldiers are bombing. Uh, those, those cities, bombing those apartment buildings, yeah, it's like mass murder, it's horrific, and yes, people, we should all want to stop U the Ukraine war, like, uh, yes, stop Ukraine war, like, that is not a, really a political statement, that's a pretty much a humanitarian statement that anybody with a conscience, um, uh, should support, uh, but we'll read his statement now. All right, so we're gonna. I'm gonna read uh, the message he sent him. It says, "Greetings. The support team has received several complaints in regard to your name on the server. Please note that using obscene language as well as personal insults, political context, provocations are prohibited. According to the game rules, your character was renamed as uh, 
Player 3707810, please refrain from using character name that has political context. Contact our support team if you require any additional information. Thank you for your understanding. Okay, so this is what this message sent out like. So I've never heard of anyone getting a message like this. Like I said, I've showed you that there's other names with so-called political context. And we should have clarified, historically, when people talk about political context, they're usually talking about uh, elected officials and or elections, um, government officials. They're not necessarily talking about... Uh, War. They're not necessarily talking about, uh, you know, legal law because that's legal conversation. Like, you know, Paul, you know, said stuff that's too political is usually used as a catch-all to stifle dissent. I mean, right? Like I said, by if you use a broad definition, I mean, technically everything is political. There's nothing in your life that is not affected by politics. Video games are political. Movies are political. Sports are political. Even the environment is affected by politics, right? Having conversation about anything could be Dean political and far too often we see uh oh that's too political as a way to uh stifle dissent i mean like for example right you'll have issues where say women are talking about issues that f affect women and people are like oh that's too political or people of color are talking about it, their experiences and certain people say oh that's too political never mind the fact that when white people talk about their experiences nobody uh says that's too political so it has like I said, a lot of times that it's too political is used to stifle dissent. I mean, this the name uh, Stop Ukraine War is, like I said, kind of, uh, it's really pretty neutral. It's not even necessarily pro-Ukraine. It's just, hey, right, what's happening in Ukraine is pretty awful. I mean, we're talking the mass murder of civilians. Most people who have a conscience uh, would support that. And the fact that they say there's been several complaints, I don't buy that. I mean, who's going to complain about a name like that? I've seen names far more offensive other uh, than that, I mean, like, I mean, like I said, I mean, I've seen, like I said, I've seen names far more offensive than that. Like, I mean, like, and they don't seem to have anything happening to them. So the fact that they, says, they seem to be singling him out, I think is wrong. Especially a time when people are questioning Nexer's ties to Russia. It's very, it's a very bad look for them. And I feel like they are totally mishandling the situation. Um, because this is, like I said, they really shouldn't be doing this. Um, like I said, there was a couple of other messages he exchanged. We'll read them. He told, he sent them to me. Right. So, and he sent a message to support and he got a reply from a guy named Noel. He says, hello, my name is Noel. Nice to meet you. Thank you for the detailed info. Let me explain the situation. Your in-game name has changed because I had political context into it. Same rule applies for every player in our game. I want to mention that the support team doesn't change names for players unless there's conflict with the game rules. Also, you can do that by yourself uh, using in-game means for that. Hope I was able to clarify. If you have any other questions, be sure to contact me. Wish you the best of luck. Okay, so he says they do, they apply this uh for the for every player in the game, but like, like I said, I've showed you they really don't. It's like I said, they're seen to be singling him out, and they tell him he can uh, change it by in-game memes. But remember, changing names in this game is not free; it costs emeralds, and you know, the, so they're forcing him to spend emeralds for this uh, to change his name if he wants to change it. Not to it just be a player and his account ID number. Um, right? He actually replies to Noel, and here's what he says. He says, hi, Noel. Thank you for your reaction. Unfortunately, you haven't clarified anything. The so-called uh, issue political context was clear to me with the initial message. I tried to explain that Stop Ukraine War has nothing political about it. It is humanitarian opinion. Nowhere in those three words am I telling uh, that Putin was right to protect the neutral state of Ukraine or that he was wrong to launch his tactical mission. Or am I saying that Ukraine is right to protect its country or, or that they should uh, help from the USA uh, or Europe to stop the Russian troops from advancing. Uh, I totally understand if I'd use something like kill Zelensky or stop Putin. Frankly, I would even understand if someone would get banned for a limited time for using that. From a humanitarian standpoint, I want the fighting to stop. In real life, I'm okay with guild wars online. The people affected by the current situation haven't asked for any political game that has... Uh, has been played over their heads. In the regard, in that regard, I don't care how or who it stopped who it stops a human sacrifice just needs to end i don't i just don't understand how a message of peace is considered to be political that being said i don't think i violated the terms of the game so i think it would be fair to give me my name back in this case so there's some is there is some moral issue with renaming uh, my account uh to stop ukraine war i like to have my original name back which is siri master i know how to change my name so that is not the issue. I just refused to pay 50 emeralds to change my name again when it shouldn't have been changed in the first place. So thank you very much for uh, giving my name back. Kind regards. 
right? So he's trying to, like I said, trying to ask for a free name change. Like if they're going to be this, like I said, at the very least they could do, they can give him a free name change. Um, because that's, like I said, really, it shouldn't should have been changed in the first place, as he explained. It's not really necessarily political. Like I said, political in this case seems to be used as a catch-all uh, to kind of stifle uh, opinions that they don't like. And that's not even, uh, like, the worst part. Um, so, like, they tell him that he has an in-game way uh, to change his name back, but he's actually uh, banned from changing his name in-game uh, for, like, 30 days. So they tell him to do that. So, yeah, like, they really just need to give him, like, a free name change, change it back to what it was before he changed, I guess. But, uh, like I said, this is, right like said, I mean, nothing he did, like I said, I mean, was worth 30 days to ban from changing your name. Like, what? I don't know. Like, this is it's just ridiculous. It's It reflects poorly on them. And uh, people's opinions, like I said, a lot of people have been quitting the game lately. A lot of people have quit uh, Hero Wars in the last month because of uh, Nexter's uh, ties to Russia. People are concerned about that, and this does not help the situation at all. And Nexter's needs to do better. And they really... Nexter's here scene, though. Like, Nexter's, you, anybody here are watching Hero Wars team, you guys need to come out stronger. You gotta condemn... Uh, Russia's invasion of Ukraine. You got to be much more explicit in your language uh, and say that what Russia is doing in Ukraine is wrong, that Russia needs to uh, withdraw its troops and end its war. Like you got, that said, that is what you guys got to do because people are starting to really question your guys' integrity and whether or not they continue should continue playing their your game. And yes, trust me, I, f I feel that. I've had people in my guild quit. I've seen people in other guilds quit. I know people in other shirts quit. Like, I mean... The population of this game has dropped pretty precipitously in the last month. I mean, it's pretty obvious. And it's because of um, Nexer's possible ties to Russia. And people are concerned about that. Nexer's really just needs to take a strong stance uh, against Russia's invasion. Supposedly, they're based in Cyprus. If they're based in Cyprus, then they should have no problem uh, condemning Russia's war in Ukraine. Anyway, um, yeah, this is more of a rant, but I feel like this was a situation that the community should know about so uh hopefully you guys found this video informative and uh yeah thank you for watching